So when I first came across you through social media and some of the YouTube videos, it was almost a, a year before I signed up. Because I like new construction. I got that new construction co-broker certification. I'm gonna do a couple of deals with new construction, but once I was seeing kind of what you were talking about, what you were teaching, and I'm just the type of person that, you know, it's like, okay, this sounds good. Let me see a little bit more careful before I really just jump on yeah, yeah. And that's why once I was able to put the money together, it was a no-brainer, which actually, I think was a year to the day. Oh, wow. <laughs> I think it was like one year ago today. And, uh, you know, again, I remember we talked a couple times. We did. Beforehand, and you had some questions when you talked to a buyer. I'm like, okay, these are buyer questions. He's letting things go. And then I kind of went, forgot about it, and you came back and was like, all right, I'm ready to go. Yep. Just, like you said, doing the due diligence, talking to you to see how you respond. Because there's so many people out there trying to sell so many different things. A lot of it, I swear, they just got out of a seminar on how to sell something, and they're not even Oh, there's some it. really good salespeople. And yeah. it's the marketing and sales can be used for good or for evil. Yes. And there's people out there that can sell you the shirt off your back like it's theirs, and you're going to buy it, and then realize that's when that regret comes in. What do you call it? Buyer's remorse. So when we first talked and setting everything up, he kept telling me, just trust the process, trust the process. And that's just kind of what I live by now. It's like, let me just trust the process. Said so six months or, you know, spend X amount, we should get that. And here's the thing, I monitor the campaigns, and I'm looking at your campaign like, I don't like the way these numbers are looking, but I didn't have communication with you. So I was like, man, there's gotta be something we can do. And then you hit me up and was like, hey, I got a closing. So I'm like, all right, I'm being overzealous. It works, because you got a closing. So we'll take that, there's ROI, perfect. Now let's see if we can optimize it even better to get better results. Or like, you know, we're talking about maybe even switching to a different community, whatever case may be. Yeah. And, you know, I was feeling kind of the same way, but I was like, let me trust the process. It's a brand new community. I already figured that it was going to be on the longer end because when we first started. Brand new communities definitely take longer because there's not as many people searching for them. Mm -hmm. And there's not as much competition, especially if you're out in like boondocks or somewhere that's not really popular. You got to wait for it to get, but you're getting first movers right. So I didn't know. And I was like, let me see how this works out. But then when you were telling me that you weren't like the numbers, I said, okay, what I'm feeling was right. We were both on the same page, but the sale came through, which was great. And now I know it works. I believe it worked. And I'm ready for us to really get this going. To like really young. Yes, exactly. 